I'm just yeah, they're right there. I'm doing, I don't even, I'm tired of your shit already. Really? Is that how we're going to start? Well, I mean, <clears throat> we are in the green room and it is B-sides. Besides what? It, no, it's just the B-sides. Besides what? Oh, they, yeah, there you go again. <laughs> there you go again with the dad jokes. That's uh, good stuff, bro. Good stuff. All right. Huh. But yeah, no, hey, uh, back, yeah. back in the green room. Uh, oh, Philly D. Mr. Gemini. Yeah, we'll, we'll tell you who it is, but we're not going to tell you what we're doing. What? Well, I mean, maybe we will. I don't know. We're not playing footsies or nothing, so it's cool. It's not, not like that. Not today, no. Well, you know, no not at the moment. Usually by accident. Well, we do have big feet, bro. Yeah, yeah. Well, oh, yes. Me. Yes, I do. It's like I forgot for a minute. I don't know. Oh, I need to. Well, then do it. I don't know. I'm already drinking mine. Oh, that was beautiful. Look at that. Oh. Yeah, that was very loud. Oh, dude, that's. <laughs> you're so I gross. I could hear a bubble on my tongue. That was lovely. Well, I mean. It is. It is the swords. It does. Uh, it it's smooth, but it is funky. It's funky. it's got that. It's got all that pop. Had too much pop. Funky. <clears throat> funky. Well, I mean, you know, Fun- the B rooms. We can do whatever we want. Funky. What Doris the Finkasaurus? Doris the Finkasaurus. <laughs> Dude, every time I hear that, it always makes me think of the other one where it's like, uh, where they. I want the. I want the donut. What is that? What is that on? Dude. Oh. When they're in the freaking stumping me right now. Right? No, because it was the well, who was the who are the ones that are like open the door, get on the floor, everybody do the don. Oh Those guys was not was. Yeah, was not was. Wow, dude, there's an archive for you. Yeah, I think that was. Uh, I think that was one of their like sketches with something. About oh no, I know what you're talking about. Right. Yes, the donut. Um, there it is. Yeah, you were, you were talking about Earth to Doris. Yeah, yeah, and it was like this really weird like um, was it like kind of like an acid jazz. It was like, bum, bum, nah, nah, nah. it's something like that. Yeah. yeah, it was really, yeah, really odd, <laughs> oddball. I know this is how my brain works. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> In, enjoy the ride. Yeah, uh, Earth, Earth to Doris by Was Not Was. What year was that? Well, oh, I mean, you wow. got your you got your fancy machine out. But. Well, no, not really, because we're using. I mean, I have this fancy machine, but oh, I don't. Cheapskate. I'd rather have like an actual fact checker because then they're not truly a part of what we're doing, which means that they're gonna be sober <laughs> i mean let's just be honest there you know. well, yeah i don't like the fact that it kind of derails the conversation and the what you know. no well oh you mean the fact checking There's just fat you know last I was time saying, i was yelling you, at you for like 10 minutes like dude why are you still on your phone because i was thinking if you were trying to say it was like the drinking that do i was like no it's not the drinking that derails it it's what we do after we drink that it's derails totally it. totally not the drinking come on <laughs> <laughs> wink wink nudge nudge <laughs> hey know what i mean you know, nudge is as good as a wing to a blind bat. Aye. 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 Yeah. Yeah, that's mm. uh, that's good stuff. Your wife? Is she a go, huh? <laughs> see, Does uh, she go, aye? I know, right? Sorry. Just kind of fell into that for a minute. Is she a need? That's what he said. Besides. Besides what? Dude, you... I mean, I do appreciate the dad jokes, I'll be honest. <laughs> no, I, I really do. I do. It's just... Um, you're a suck. I'll be honest. <laughs> Uh, well, I appreciate your honesty. That's you know, what I do, bro. Always, always, you know, number one in the four agreements right there. I, I try to be, you know. Even if it's a tad painful, you know, you don't care. It's, it's a lovely thing, the fact that you can just let go of that. That's that's awesome. Well, see, this is where I would say, actually, it's more of when you're being impeccable, even though it possibly could hurt because that's how the person perceives it, doesn't mean that that's how you did it or how it should have come out. If it was impeccable, then it would probably be done in a manner where it if it was perceived as that, it's completely on the other person. Like the proverbial band-aid, you know, just mm. just tear it off as fast as possible kind of thing. You know, ah. this, this is going to hurt. I'm not going to be, and I'm not going to lie to you, but I'm going I'm to make it quick. Just, you know, yeah. uh, on the count of three. One, you know, just like that. Yeah, I heard that about you. But on bunch. See, my dad jokes are way better, bro. They, they got some funk on them. They say yes. Yeah, you can say that again. Yeah, you might want to see your doctor about that. <laughs> what? What? I'm sure they make some kind of an ointment or a salve for that. You know? uh, yeah, don't worry. It's not one of those things where you have to like make phone calls. Be like, so uh, just got to tell you. No, no, it's not like that. <laughs> At least I hope not. I don't know. Wow. No. I mean, you do. My funk's pretty funky. I'm just saying. I'm Doris the Funkosaurus. Mm, yeah. 
Yeah. D- hey, Doris. Or the Doris. Yeah, two coffees, please. Yeah, that's... And maybe a couple of those donuts in that glass over there. What do you say, Doris? Yeah, yeah, that's what it is. Earth the Doris. Come in, Doris. That's a weird song. Uh, yeah, no, I finally caught up to you. Sorry. <laughs> Thank you for recalling that for me. I appreciate it. Oh, Super. you wanted that whole thing. I'm sorry. Yeah, you brought it back around again. Totally. Yeah, that's what we do. You made it the again. You made it funny. That's, that's what we do. I've been picking that up through osmosis. That's... Through... <laughs> 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 well, that go, dude. That was on our our last episode. We were uh, that we did where we're talking about how you know if you're if you hang around like nine broke people, you'll be the tenth broke one. But if you hang around nine rich people, you'd be the tenth rich one. And you you know you were like osmosis, and, you know, law of attraction, but all that kind of stuff. Yeah, I think mean, it's deeper than that, though. You know, because it's where you're headed at, right? You know, the, well, the fact that you entertain the idea of of hanging out with people that are maybe a step above your normal. Which, if you'd say stature, I, don't know, I hate using that word, but well, to me, it's more of just uh, like a caliber or um, caliber. Well, so use gun terminology. Well, so this goes back to that whole thing we were talking about with like theta and stuff, where it's like the fact that you are absorbing what's around you. So if your whole life you were raised around rich people, you're going to act that way too, and if. You know, you just kind of like luck into it in a sense where you just always have that job available or you know somebody or, but that's, that's like the group that you run with. Same thing if, you know, you didn't and you're like broke as hell and you ain't got no cool friends or nothing and you all just sit around picking pockets. Well, then, yeah. What, what do you have to aspire to? Well, Man. but that, but that's what your program with the thinking is just like, this is, this is what it is. So oh, when the- you, when you flip the switch and you just start hanging out with those other people, do it, it, Deprograms you in a sense, or reprograms you. It really does. Reminds me of the, the powerful uh, Jordan Peterson rule from the Twelve Rules, right? The uh, comparing yourself to other people versus comparing yourself to what you were yesterday, right? Oh, yeah, I said it was yeah, like Eric Thomas, where he was talking about uh, you know always checking everybody else's stats. Like, what are your stats? Yeah, yeah, same kind of thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah but what, what about it? But JP was saying the same thing, you know. JP, what are you like? JP. Are you two buddies? Yeah, they were, we're buddies. You know, are you like I hang out it, on the weekends. I read one of his books, and I think I'm an expert. Yeah, but you, you guys like go golfing and hit up and hit up the sizzler afterward. No, I wouldn't be able to probably eat with him. It'd be really weird. Oh, because yeah, he, yeah, because <laughs> you would eat all meat, and I would eat all vegetables. Well, and maybe it would work. Maybe we just get a like. If well, you got the 96, or I could just get all the sides that go with it. You know. Well, but that's the thing is, I don't oh, wait. Think, <laughs> I don't. I don't know if. Um, I don't know if he's actually like all still full carnivore or not, because technically when you do it, you're only supposed to do it for 28 days and then see the reaction and then like work from it from there. So I don't think the intention is to always only be. I think that's a temporary component to just having that kind of a lifestyle. So he might be like primarily meat, but he might get a steak and a salad. Maybe, maybe I'm or like or like some breadsticks with you. I know. I remember hearing him talk about it a couple of different times, though. That it's a it's a very restrictive diet. Like it was pretty much like you. It's almost disgusting because you kind of have to go up and you have to order like, you know, two of the largest steaks you have, please. Well, but you, yeah, medium rare. The, you, <laughs> when I was on that, like that one night, you and I, we went out to dinner and stuff, and I like looked the dude straight in the eye. I was like, "Here's the deal. I'm gonna order two plates. You're gonna give him all the sides and give me all the meat." And he's just looking at me like, "What?" And he looks at you and you're like. Yeah, bro. Like two baked potatoes, you know. Oh, you do. <laughs> yeah, you, I mean, you had oh, because it was like all the vegetables and stuff. So you just you picked all the vegetables. I got what was it like salmon and steak, and I'm just sitting there. I was just like, yeah, put the meat on my plate. Put all the sides over for him. I'm like, I'm like this is not a joke. Tell your chefs, make this happen. <laughs> yeah, we wound up tipping the crap. Well, I wound up tipping the crap out of that dude. You were like half cocked the whole night. It was hilarious. <laughs> I was half cocked the whole night. Well, yeah, because that was that night you. Uh, it's not even well, you, because you were riding, but you were also drinking. I'm like, bro, I can't let you ride. It ain't happening. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was all responsible and shit. And I was like, come on, we're going to go get food. You're hungry. I'm hungry. We're going to do this. Let's do this. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, see, I'll just, I'll keep rolling with it, man. You yeah, bring- and I'm, I always take a sip of beer at the wrong time. I mean, you've done that to me, but I held my. Oh, you were just saying like, oh. yeah, making me laugh, and you know. the bubbles tickle. <laughs> <laughs> well, thankfully, it didn't. You know, 
that's the next thing that can come right out the nose. You don't want that to happen. That's oh, because it usually hurts. <laughs> it's burning. That means it's working. No, no, it's not. It hurts. <laughs> it was like lemon lime soda. I think the first time I did that. Or was it orange? Oh no, orange. It's probably orange a treat actually. Or- orange drink or orange, orange soda. Orange soda. So bubbles and everything. Yeah, that mm. was fun. Yeah, bubbles. But you're laughing while it's happening, though. So it's <laughs> the bubbles tickle. That's why makes makes me laugh. They tickle. <clears throat> They're tickling my brain. Oh, makes I don't me know cool. where I got it from. If it's an actual sniglet, but I always call that snarfing. <laughs> yeah, no, that's um. Well, no, what was dude? Snarf was He Man's little little John, like his cat, his cat <laughs> thing. <laughs> well, that was what he would say. I think, yeah, snarf. May I don't know cringer. Yeah, was it? Yeah, there you go. It was Cringer, yeah. Yeah. Maybe also the Snorkels, maybe? I don't know. Wasn't that? It's, who, snarf? Snar- yeah, the Snorkels. Hey, all wet. No, I don't remember, I don't remember them saying Snarf. No. I don't know. No, total tangent. Anyway. Definitely cartoon. Yeah, def, def, definitely yeah. cartoon. De- definitely. Might have been Wapner, though. <laughs> oh. Kmart sucks. <clears throat> yeah. So what's been going on, man? I um, and then you uh, you just got back from somewhere, didn't you? Did you have fun? Did you I, do your thing? I did, I did. You did, know, did you get on the good foot and do the bad thing? I got on the good foot and did the good thing. Boring. Yeah, well, <laughs> boring can be boring. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it can be. That's why it's boring. It depends on how you define boring, but. And some things I like, people consider boring. But no, it was fun. It was, you know, just chilling, hanging with family, doing family stuff, and going to the beach. Right by the beach. What you looking at? I'm hearing something in the background. Wait. <laughs> yeah, no, no. It's, I'm, it's I'm, probably I'm, like the chair makes weird. Oh, and you're rock, and it's just wow. As I'm leaning, yeah, maybe I should get Dude, this the, new this new stuffs, man. It's like it's very sensitive. It is very sensitive. Yeah, so don't don't fucking move. You don't. Well, you wanted me to when I'm not talking to be way off the way off the mic. So um, that's what I was doing, and then and then and then and then and then. And then, and then I mean, is it just me, or do you not hear like there's this like clicking? I can't, yeah, we were. There's there's a clicking. All right. <laughs> Dead air. No, Dead I air. just because I want to hear. Uh, do we're in the? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you want to figure it out now? Before here's here's the know. deal: if people are listening to this right now, they're probably like wrecked. <laughs> Why do you just automatically say that? Maybe, maybe well, because because we're <laughs> birds of a feather. So if they're going to be listening to this, they're going to be like, "Bro, I've been there, man. I totally have been there before." So uh, I don't know. I guess. So moving on. Move, move. <clears throat> so. I was at the beach. I was doing family stuff, going swimming in a pool and at the beach, hanging out, getting some sun. What were you doing? You don't hear that? I do hear that. Yeah, what is that? It's a rhythmic ticking. Yeah. Bro, I have no idea. Is it something of yours? It sounds like a kitchen clock. Just pull a battery out of something, man. You're, you're right there. He's now looking around the room. It's like the telltale heart, man. It's driving him nuts. He's going to start digging up pieces of the wall. I don't know what's going on right now. Uh-oh. You okay? Whatever, dude. I don't know. Maybe it'll fix itself. Turn the radio up, bro. <laughs> <laughs> You got everybody creeped out now. They're like, what is. I don't talk over it. Just ignore it. It'll go away. Just like kids. No. (laughs) Dude, that's not right. No, that's. Oh, I know. It's not true. You hand him a tablet. Oh, dude. Wait, tablet, tab? 
Huh? Dude, were you trying to give your kid acid? No, what? No. Oh, a tablet. tablet. I said a tablet. Oh, jeez, oh. man. I, I can't give you a tab if you haven't gotten anything. <laughs> Let me get a Pepsi free. If you want a Pepsi guy, you got to pay for it. <laughs> oh, I totally just, I got it on me. What are you, with the Navy or something? <laughs> when did you jump ship? <laughs> anyway. You. You. You're good. What? No, stop. I don't. Ah, oh, it's gross. It's all. Uh, What's the matter? It's sticky. There we go. I really don't know what's going on over here on the other side of the table. Gonna, it's B-sides and I'm getting my shit together. <laughs> I'm going to sip my soda. <laughs> That's boring. <laughs> No, so what were you up to? Right? Oh, Jesus. Besides praising the, the good Lord. I don't know. What? <laughs> <laughs> uh, what the, oh, no, you're saying names over there. I just. Oh, well, oh, hi. Oh, dad joke. Bad. Bad that was dad not joke. A, that was not a dad. Just, would you? No, you. 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 I don't have to tell you I shit. I can't have a conversation with this guy. I well, because we're not supposed to be having a conversation right I'll now. Maybe I'll just talk to you folks. I'm How have be, you been doing? I'm supposed to be warming up. We're warming up. We're, we're doing equipment checks and drinking. <laughs> and hearing ticks. Yeah, dude, that's dri it's driving me nuts. I mean, most likely we'll find it on the... Um, on the other side, you know, so when we're done with this, because we never know how long this is going to take. Might not, might not even be picked up by anything. I don't. Well, but that's what I'm saying. What are you saying? I'm, I'm, I'm telling you. Dude, don't make me jump this table. <laughs> I'm not going to jump the table. I don't even want to sit up. <laughs> <laughs> but see, that's. Oh, uh, Southern, by the way. Oh, yeah, dude. That's yeah. really good. But see, and that's the thing. This is what I always love about doing the green room. This is why when you were like, yo, we should totally. I was like, you know what? We really do. Because I, I, I remember we got to that one point where we had recorded so many freaking episodes where it was just like, dude, we need it. We both need to take a break. And you were still almost like ready to keep going full steam. And I'm like, no, dude, we, we need to sit back for a hot minute. So which was just ironic because I was just like two years up your butt about it. Like, <laughs> the, get on the sh I swore. And then all of a sudden you're just like, I want more. Let's do it again. <laughs> but, you know, and I think at that point is when I really started to celebrate and appreciate having having this. Yeah. Well, yeah, because we yeah. this is also like we get to check into. Well, this. In case I mean, we haven't talked recently, which sometimes that happens. This has kind of always been, I think it's gotten kind of developed over the years, but this has always been here. The, the conversation side of things has always been here. It's because you like me. I, I put up with you. Yeah, that that's guy speak for you like me. And you're I know, you know this. You're <laughs> just as cute for the radio as I am, mister. Dude, I totally have a face for radio. I really do. <laughs> and and I'm okay with that, you know? It's all right. I mean I do all right. It it do what it do, baby. What do you, why are you looking at me cross eyed now? I support See, all right. See, you know the what? chair is making noise. You're making hear, noise. I don't hear that ticking noise. I think it was all in your head. I think there was water dripping somewhere and it stopped. That's why I said just ignore it. It'll go away. Turn off the radio. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm surprised you're not drinking moonshine tonight, man. Just the just the swords. Well, it's still early. <clears throat> it's still early. Ish. I mean, ish. You're ish. You're ish. Dude, what? But so, yeah, what's going on with you, man? Um, I don't know. I'm really happy about... <laughs> Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Whoa. Sorry. The swords, bro. Sorry. Fucking swords. Yeah. Every you know, time. That's, uh, that's how it goes down. You know, it's all good. Sorry that. <laughs> yeah, no, um, I'm just, I'm doing my thing, you know, chilling, um, enjoying life. Working the hustle. I, I got, I always got hustles going, yeah, <laughs> doing my thing, but I'm at a place where it's like, I want to, I want to get back out and golf more. Yeah, I said the G word. I want to go out and golf more. I need it, dude. I need I need that connection with the with Mother Earth and being out in nature and it's. I mean, everybody's got their thing, right? Yeah. Well, my everybody's thing is like not having other people around. <laughs> <laughs> uh, dude, I try to explain to people like I really am an introvert, but like no one believes me because I'm always very like active and out there and like willing to do stuff and just you know. But I I it, I'd rather spend the majority of my time at home chilling and not sleeping. So I kind of. 
I think even to a greater extent, a lot of ec- people that were con- would cons- be considered extroverts, you know, from the outside, are, are actually have to spend so much time in an introverted state. I definitely think that. Well, I think no matter in what, there's so. always going to be a, some form of a balance, right? And that's how I think me is I want that extreme isolation because I do such extreme, like when I go out and I'm like meeting and greeting. Extreme. No, when I'm going out and like meeting and greeting and like doing events and things and you know what I mean? Like always talking to people. I have to be, but I'm, I'm always like on. Like, so I'm just like, you know, like you flip the switch and it's like, I got to do my thing. <clears throat> well, it's but enjoyable, but it can be, it can oh, be exhausting. Very exhausting. Yeah. Yeah, very. Which is why I'm like, I need, I need that extreme isolation. That's why I feel like golf to me, especially being the type of person where it's like, I really enjoy nature. Cause again, I feel it grounds you. It just, you know, reconnects you back. Cause I believe that like, you know, like we were saying all before, like how the, the stars and the rocks and all that, like we're all made of the same stuff and like, that's where we came from. So the fact is if we come out of the heavens and it molded with something here on this earth, then, you know, we're just as much a part of this earth as we are the stars. So it's like, you got to recognize that. You know, at least in my mind. Absolutely. What is that? What golf is for you? I'm sorry. Well, it, I mean, it's kind of a, well. That's what I was saying. It's like it's that's a, the thing that like grounds me. Right. So you know, as much as I try to like pray and meditate and put the good energy out for the uh, the world and the universe and all that kind of stuff, I also want to make sure that you know I'm connecting. So I'm I'm not only connecting with the stars, but I'm also connecting with with the you know the earth and the ground. Yeah, and I would say that's that's a a weird thing too. Not that I I don't have a whole lot of. Ex- Dude, don't even. <laughs> anyway, um, I totally lost my train of thought there. That's great. Dude, Cheers, bro. Yeah. Cheers. We in the green room, I baby. I think we discovered what this sound was. But I, I do. Do you know what? <clears throat> it's all good. Yeah, that's why there's a rhythm to it. <laughs> rhythm gonna get you. Oh, dude, that's, I was like, that's weird. It stopped. It did. <laughs> And then it's cut up. Dude, there, oh, <laughs> that, remind, that reminds me of like, uh, there's a, um, a How I Met Your Mother episode where, where he's like, he's like, let me, he's like, I, I can tell you how it went. He's like, here, I'll, uh, I'll even, you know, he's like, oh, paint, what do you have? Oh, I forget how he calls it. But he basically, he's like, yeah, it sounded like this. He's like, er, 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 and he's like selling it for like thirty seconds to a minute, and then, uh, yeah, dude, Neil, Pat- Neil Patrick Harris, man, that guy cracks me up. His his delivery is super dope. Sorry, my mind went on its own tangent, but that's all right. Of course it did. That's that's what all you do. I mean, that's that's all you're good for. I'll be honest. It's tangents, <laughs> and that's why I brought you to the party, pal. Your mom, your mama must really care about your education. <laughs> 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 Oh Jesus, dude! And see, I don't see. I don't. I've. It kind of like. I I don't get why like you and I for some reason like that's the thing like that's always been like our like one kind of connection is just quoting shit and just the way the conversation turns into that and like where it goes and I just I've I've never quite understood it. It's like a, we're like a fucking unicorn or something. Where is it all coming from? You know, it's like how does a rainbow work? How does policy track? Work? I don't know. <laughs> What's on the television? <laughs> no shit. We are the penguin. Uh, which hopefully one day will blow up. <laughs> Boom! Yeah, that was a dad joke because it wasn't literal. The penguin on your television set will now explode. How does he know that? <laughs> it was an inspired guess. It was an inspired guess. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah, which I... Uh, I had to follow that up with a sip, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was so good I had to take a drink. Mmm. <laughs> Yeah, I rubbed my belly when I did that too. You're welcome. What's the uh, oh what? What's the no? What's the uh, where where did where did you go? Why are you? Where did I? I'm over here now, <laughs> and then I'm over here. What? <laughs> on your left, on your right. I could actually probably no. I'm not going to do that. I don't want to do none of that. What's the, what's what do you want to do? Yeah, it looked like you were getting ready to do like I don't know an algia with that. Oh wait, I mean Ouija. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Is it like you see? It's, it's like Agino when it's like you know. I always say angina. It's my it's my <laughs> angina. It's like wait, isn't isn't that Agino? It's like yeah, that's so. Oh, you're not. I feel like what? Oh, there you go. Why are you touching my equipment? No, it wasn't your equipment. It was just the cable. No, I was equipment adjacent. <laughs> it's not your equipment. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> 
<laughs> Dude, that's I don't know what that is, but that was fucked up. Oh, all right, I'll give you that one. That was a pretty good one. <clears throat> they're not all dead jokes, right? Well, I mean, well, technically, they're not I mean, dead. Anything jokes. I say is a yeah. No, it's not because it's so horrible that it can't even be classified, which is hilarious because dad jokes are supposed to be horrible and they're just that horrible that they just don't count. Well, when you say granddad jokes. You said granddad jokes. Well, yeah, because that's when they think like talking about taffy or some shit's hilarious. You know, it's like when you're five, you want to talk about like farts, and when you're like ninety-five, you want to make jokes about taffies and cows. And it's like, bro, read the room, read the room. Uh, uh, my my grandpa was awesome, but he would tell some of the some of the raunchiest jokes. Not raunchiest. I'm sorry, that's a little overboard. But so he would he told a good dirty joke. Wait, is this the same one that asked your soon-to-be wife like, how much is it going to take? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> how much? How much is it going to take for what? For you to marry my grandson? How, how much to get him and, off my hands? Come on. And she said a number, and I really don't need to say that out loud. But you know, she said <laughs> five dollars. She said a number, and my my dad is behind her, like up, up higher. <laughs> yeah, you you deserve more. Keep going. <laughs> it's gonna be hell on you. I'm just warning you now. I mean, she has to put up with me sometimes, so you know. But I'm kind of scared of her because you know she she carries weapons. I know, it's scary. Well, apparently she thinks you're somewhat good for me. So, well, that is true. Not really, not really sure how that works out, but it's pretty cool. Well, I do remember, man. There was that's a that's a good story, and I think I've told you that before. Where she kind of came to me and was just like, "Hey, you know, I don't I don't really know what you guys got going on, but I, I really feel like you know, one, you were really good for him, but two, you guys could kind of like." You know, because we were on a spot where, you know, we were good with each other. We just hadn't been, like, hanging out and stuff. You know, I was I was off doing all my shit, finishing school and a bunch of other things. And, you know, so it was, you had you, kids and, I mean, because they were just, like, kid kids. You know, now they're starting to get, but, you know, so the combination of the timing, mean, all of a sudden it was just like, oh, yeah, you know what? Yeah, I think at the time she just wanted me to make new friends. And I'm like, you know, yeah. she's trying to convince me, like, hey, how about these people? You know, we, we hang out with them all the time. And I'm like, yeah, they were acquaintances. Like, I mean, they're cool and all, but, I mean, you're lucky. I mean, the way I say friend, it's like you may have five in your lifetime, and I think you you can count yourself lucky. Dude, you know what? And I actually, I, I sat down and thought about this uh, a little bit ago about not only how many friends I have, but how old of a relationship, like, I've known those people for. You know, quite a few of them are, like, decades, you know, which is not a lot of people can say that, which I, I think is, like, pretty dope. And, and and the friendship is time tested, I meaning yeah. like when you're at your lowest, they're still there. It's not like yeah, because you and I've been through some stuff, which is why originally we we kind of stopped talking a while back, right? But then we you know we did eventually patch it up and like we were all good. That's why I was like we were just like on a pause. Well, that was a painful fall from the tree of trust. Um, well, yeah, and but, but we don't have to rehash that. Um, well, but I mean, I'm all good. I mean, honestly, I think. Uh, retrospect is we both kind of had our own set of expectations without verbalizing it and then once we did and you know kind of saw each other's perspectives and we're just like yeah you know like fuck all that bullshit because yeah it didn't do us any good it's weird like in retrospect thinking about how much time i spent actually loathing myself for the whole situation so not to go in detail about it but well yeah yeah, because i mean yeah we've again we've already hashed this shit out right (laughs) But yeah, no, because so yeah, when she was just like, "Yo, bro," and I was just like, "You know what that is?" And at that at that point, I think we had almost just we. I was just about to move pretty like pretty close to you because most of our lives, like we've lived pretty pretty near each other, other than I think like within fifteen twenty minutes on probably. average, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but you know, at one point, yeah, it was a couple hours because I moved, you know, middle of the freaking state and shit. Yeah, this kid used to take my bike so he could meet me in the morning at the, my bus stop so yeah, we could dude. ride to school together. Yeah, and which I think is hilarious because I think I was the first stop. So I would like just the fact of going to yours was like an extra 20 minutes. So I would still leave the normal time I would, but riding the bike to your house would get me there enough where we could have like two or three smokes apiece. And then like, you know, get on the bus to go to freaking like middle school and shit. I don't know about two or three, but... I do. Definitely a solid two, I think. Yeah. Oh, no, dude. We, we were usually, like, grabbing. We, we would almost always get the third, and then it was occasionally that fourth one. We were just like, what the heck? Is Mrs. K late again? What the hell? You, like, light it up, and it's like, so that's how you get your food to get to the table. I remember the one. Wasn't it the one morning she was like, she was like, go ahead. 
<laughs> just, Hurry it up, fellas. Yeah. I don't know if you'd find a bus driver to do that anymore. Yeah, no, I know. Dude, dude, Mrs. K was dope, man. She was like my favorite bus driver ever. She was pretty cool. Yeah, man. She Mrs. put up with our asses. Mrs. K, if you're out there, much love. Yeah, right. Which, I, well, oh. Who knows? I'm, we always, she always told, like, I remember the first time I met her, she's like, my name is, and she's like, but just call me Mrs. K because that's what everyone does because nobody can pronounce it. And I was just like, all right, cool. Mrs. K it is. <laughs> Even though I was just like, I mean, I can, I can pronounce that. Yeah, it's nothing, you know. Ms. K. Yeah. It was just, or yeah, to me it was just. Name. Yeah. Well, yeah, to me it was like a, a typical like Polish name, so it was like no big deal. You know, I, I I've been raised around like multiple cultures my whole life until I freaking got out here, and then it was like nothing but like snowflakes, and it's just like, wow, this is great. Awesome. Nothing but snowflakes. Yeah, a bunch of unique individual white spectacles. But um, Spe- bunch spectacles. Yeah, well, each each snowflake is special. It deserves its its spotlight. I'm gonna have no, another beer. No two snowflakes are alike. This is true. Oh, yeah. Oh, there we go. oh, I'm gonna get in there. Easy. Oh, <clears throat> making some R-rated noises over there. <laughs> Sorry, I had to do it. It's the transmission. I'm shifting into gear. It's, it's like that. What? It, yeah, it's the oh the t- okay, the transmission. I mean, plus, dude, it's green. Why are you always busting my chops in the green room? Oh, it's because you can't do it on. Yeah, all right, I get it. Mm, okay. Yeah, you saw you. What, that's you, okay. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's okay. That's all right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, dude. I mean, so again, yeah, I am. Um, I really appreciate the whole. I appreciate you. Dude, I appreciate you. But no, I do. I really do appreciate doing the uh, the green rooms and you know being able to continue this content. And I, I, I the, don't, the I'm sometimes, sorry, the the B sides. Well, no, be like well, because we're in the green room and we're letting people record that or listen to our recording of that. You know, which is you know, it's all recording. The, <laughs> I don't Are know. You guys the, recording us? The, I mean, somebody might be. Or I guess right. Yeah. Do one day. We might have other people trying to rebroadcast us, and YouTube pops them and cuts their video off. Sup? Mm. Yeah, that happened to us because you effed up. And I told you, I was like, you. Maybe we could have a whole new platform. We are a platform. You know, develop from this. It'd be like the Wild Stallions. How they I can jump off the high dive and, <laughs> and heal the world. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, what is it? God gave rock and roll to you, <laughs> put it in your soul to give it to everyone. Hell yeah. Yeah, man. I mean, yeah. Which dude? What's up, <laughs> w- William Sadler? Right, William Sadler was freaking the Reaper in that, in the second one, the Bogus Journey. Oh yeah, yeah, dude. He was, dude. But he, oh, he's actually a really, I really enjoy him as an actor. He usually winds up playing like cowboy cop kind of a thing, but he's also, uh, I think he's like country music. So he like plays and sings, and he's actually like, pretty, dude, he's pretty good. Is he like singer songwriter? I think so. Oh, yeah, I think oh. he's got some original stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah, so not only can he like play others, but yeah, I think he I think he has his own stuff. Cool. But yeah, no, he's dude, he's mad though. I like that game. But yeah, dude, I always always cracks me up when I think because, you know, he usually plays again like, you know, the good guy hero kind of type, and here he is the freaking bald headed Grim Reaper. I'm it's like S. nine Boston feet Esquire. tall. You are not Bill S. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> you are not either Theodore no Ted Theodore Logan. No, you're none of them. Together we are. We are not wild, <laughs> dude. We're we're barely we're barely friends. I don't even know you. How did you find me? <laughs> Nobody even believes you right now. Nobody believes it, dude. Everybody believes me. No, I no. am always honest, especially on the mic, because I am from France, and you saw that on the internet. Bonjour. <laughs> <laughs> so you get me. You get me. Oh. <laughs> But see, dude, this is why. The, all right, again, this is. Dude, this is why I'm pretty sure whoever is actually like listening to this stuff. Yeah, man, it's like it's like 3 a.m. They're on their way home, or they're like 6 a.m. and they're like tr- you know a trucker or something. And dude, we appreciate you guys so much, like all all of the fam, man, like for real. What's but going on? I appreciate on? I appreciate you. I appreciate all of our people. What's going on right now on the other side of the mic? That's what I want to know. Well, that's where they can email us, dude. 
I'm telling you in directionsofmusic.org, in case you guys haven't heard enough, I-M-T-E-L-L-I-N-Y-O-U at directionsofmusic.org. Mm. Yeah, it's like, wow, that, that it was just like, rolls. rolls. It just rolls. Yeah. yeah, I'm telling you. It's like Naina Jad. It just comes out. It just happens. Naina. Not, not going to work here anymore. <laughs> yeah, I did that. That's all right. Yeah. Well, but I mean, you know, we're in the green room doing our B-side stuff, warming up. That's right. I have nipples, Greg. Could you milk me? (laughs) I'd rather not. Dude. Oh, that wasn't actually a line in the movie. I'm sorry. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, yeah, yeah. No, but, Uh, all right, cool. Um, Are you? Are you? I mean, it's a little warm in here, and I've been drinking, so not really. Oh, I see what you did there. Yeah, no. I believe it goes, are you cool? Like how? <laughs> okay. Yeah, and I did the I did the freaking the motions and everything. Uh yeah. Yeah, did well, the, so were you saying we're we good? Well, I mean, I th- I don't know. Do you, how loaded do you want to get before we're supposed to be serious? We're supposed to be serious? Dude, um, I didn't get the memo, remember? I'm not, I'm not in the mailing list. <laughs> I, th- I thought you were the mailing list. <laughs> you said the postmaster general doesn't like me. That's what you told me. Well, somebody had to... Uh, I think you're lying. No, I... I wish I was, buddy. I wish I was. Oh, it hurts me. Down in the cockles. <laughs> you don't have any cockles. <laughs> That's true. I left them at home. It's in the purse with the... Uh, <laughs> put, put them in the safe. That's where my husband said it was best for me to keep them. <clears throat> so. Uh, so you think you're ready? For some football? <laughs> I had too much pop. Uh, how do we get back to Madden? That's what we do. It's, it's full circle. It's like, you know, the drain and the toilet. Full. S- but when it's, you know. It's more like a. When we're down under because then it goes backwards. It's more like a spiral. You're a but, spiral. You, but, what, you we're know. a unicorn. Our horn is spiral and sparkly and shiny. It makes the world a better place. And we told oh. them listen to the radio at a reasonable volume between the hours. Of the <laughs> I, just got a, I just got a text from one of my dudes. It's my, dude, you know, it's my bro, my little bro. Right, right. Yeah. Yeah, that dude. And he's trying to, he was trying to tell me, look at that shit. Two Jay-Z swapped, Ford F-150, yeah, Hoonigan shit. Oh, it's dope as fuck. Nice. Yeah, I already watched it. <laughs> I'm going to tell him he's late. Oh, but these are probably going to be pissed because I didn't show him. But it's like, dude, you, you're up on that shit because he introduced me, so he should have known. Right? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He can't be mad at you. I mean, he can be, but... He's my little brother, so <laughs> sorry. But no, so he's, he's my good. he's my little brother, so he's you know. I'm gonna tell him he's on the mic right now, even though he's not. I'm just like I'm texting. It's the green room. We're allowed to do this, right? Uh, are you allowed to text people while you're having a conversation? I guess I don't know. Whatever. The fuck you. Are you cheating on me? Are you breaking up with me? <laughs> 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 oh, dude. Yeah, no. Well, I mean, so I think this is probably a good time to go ahead and break. All right, three, two, one, break. I don't do because what am I breaking? I can't carry the conversation. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't carrying shit Dude, with your bad knees. I w- <laughs> Ding. There you go. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Mm. Oh, <laughs> no, week. dude. See, <laughs> but see, I I do it as because you said we should be doing it, which I hate. All right. So the fact that I used to do restaurants and stuff, man, when we had the freaking bell and do cooks and waitresses. Hate that sound. Dude, no, 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 no. Hate? <laughs> <laughs> That's adorable. <laughs> Loathe. Doesn't even scratch the surface. Nightmares happen over bells and printers. Shit you not, man. Yeah, the ding. No. <laughs> Yeah, well, dude, it's the fact that I used to like doing restaurants, running kitchens, all that stuff. Every chance I had, that bell, pff, trash. 
F you, you ain't getting. That's what I, that's what I was saying last time. Gotta if sneak, anything, I would sneak use... up behind in the back of your house and just in the middle of the night. No, dude, no. If anything, we would use the bell. I forget where I picked this up from, but we would use the bell when whenever the, like somebody would tip. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Like whatever it was, if like anybody tipped, that's it was a just positive like positive sound right there. Well, it's positive reinforcement for conditioning. Psychology. Was the bell actually the same bell you would use for everything else? Well, no, it was just for tips, just right. to see how it feels. We taught it. All right. Dude, well, you I'm, can't say the R word. You're right. I'm sorry. It means, um, you're it means supposed to, to say Ricola. It means to slow down. That's terrible. You can't use that word. Well, do you, it, well, I mean, to some people. <clears throat> dude, come on. This is what I'm saying. I can't carry what, the conversation. Well, I don't know why. No. Dude, come on. I'm supposed to carry the conversation. Dude, because, it's so early. Because this man is typing on his phone. It's early. I'm trying to type, but you are not doing shit for me right now. Ouch. <laughs> what am I supposed to be? <laughs> Hey, what's going on in there? <laughs> what is this, like 1940s vaudeville on the radio or something? <laughs> what am I supposed to be doing over here? I don't know. T entertaining the crowd. Dude, I'm <laughs> sorry if... I'm going to. I'm going to do that by this. Dude, put the... I swear to God. <laughs> Ice cream's in the back. <laughs> no, that... All right, that joke's hilarious. Hold on. Yeah, you... Uh, so... I'm watching. Ask me a question or some shit. I'm watching as he methodically types. Dude, this is not methodical. Stuff into his. Or even maniacal. Maniacal? It's not any M word Everything whatsoever. What? It's not even an S word. Do you like how I did S that? S word? Dude, you're an S word. I'm a liquid S word. <laughs> yeah, sugar, honey, iced tea. Okay. Yeah. Sugar, honey. I know how to spell. I can read. <laughs> <laughs> Ding. Oh man! Right, right. Yeah, dude. You know, what? I'm almost curious with all the equipment we have. If we actually got like an uh, an, an upgraded like, because I mean the mics we have are pretty dope. But if we actually like upgraded a hair, which dude, it's a huge jump, man. Holy crap! Going do going from these to the next step, it's ridiculous. The price jump. It's like three to four times depending on what you're doing because of the name and shit. But I mean, they are. I hear they're worth it. I'm just saying. Uh, maybe that's the uh, maybe that's my birthday present to me. Imagine for a minute, and this is hypothetical. Imagine if you can. Imagine having as many as four people directly under you. <laughs> <laughs> I had no idea where you're going with that, and so when you did, I was just <laughs> like, "Dude, okay, okay, I see what you did there. All right, so you're gonna fire Samir, and you're gonna give me a raise." Yeah, that guy works his butt off here, man. Yeah. They 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 they, they took my stapler. <laughs> I said no salt, no salt on the margarine. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I can't even do it. Okay, I, can, I, can, I cannot. When I look at you and you make me laugh. That's... <clears throat> well, they got my clothes around when you said that. <laughs> might might be a little judgy. I look at shit. your face and then I laugh. That was so hurtful. <laughs> That's exactly what happened. I looked at your face, and your face made me laugh. Oh, I look miss, at, I miss, look at I my miss, face. It happens all the time, right? I misread how you meant that. I'm sorry. Oh, thank you. I'm like a clown. I get it. I'm laughing for you. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I was... All right, so like... No, 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 no. I was just about to... No, the... Um, <clears throat> The uh, the younger and I were like hanging out and whatever, and she uh, she heard that where she was like, "Wait, what does that mean?" And I was just like, "All right, so here's the deal, like, because typically it's just like you know, whenever people say it, it's like I, I'm not laughing at you, you're like I'm laughing with you. I'm not laughing, but it's yeah. like yeah, what happens when it's like I'm not <laughs> laughing, and then you know, typically you're just like, oh, uh, yeah, there's like typically yeah, there's no rebuttal, and you're just like I'm laughing for you. <laughs> 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 When she heard that, she's like, I don't get it. What is what does that mean? Like that's ridiculous. I don't know. It made me laugh. Mm. Uh, I just turned my headphones down. I think it's I might have had them up too much. I'm okay. They're so loud. They are loud. They were loud. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but, <laughs> but I mean We're not gonna talk about that. Not to judge, but you know, it it wasn't 
I mean, well, you know, it was, I, I guess it was typical. <laughs> God, I feel so bad for so many ladies, if that's really what it's are, like. Do they listen to this show? Because are they going to hear us talking about? Maybe. Possibly. Dude, that's hilarious. Engaging in, a, in something. Hey, dude, they heard me a few times too, man. That's how we get down. It's like three companies. Well, I mean, I would imagine it's a little different from the lower level, but yeah, yeah. Um, and now they're maybe possibly even listening to us discuss it. So, I mean, <laughs> maybe we just shouldn't. I mean, just, <laughs> it's just inappropriate. <laughs> it's the B sides while we're inside the green room. This is how it happened. This is how we do it. Just sit back and relax. Are we in the tree of trust? Let it happen. <laughs> Why are you touching me like that? What? Stop touching me. <laughs> bruh, bruh, don't even. Don't even. That's that was after. No, seriously, there's a, like there's like a brick wall between us right now. Well, a table. Is that, is that what you call my penis? <laughs> dude. Wow. All right. I mean I got you, family that's listening to this, dude. <laughs> no. What do you don't look at me with that tone of voice right now? We're in the green room. That's all good. This is where we let it all hang out. Yeah, literally and... Let my hair down. Bro. Let my hair down. I don't know. Well, that's great, thanks. Just, yeah, go ahead. My mom has diabetes. You want to make fun of that, too? <laughs> <laughs> no, that was... I'm sorry, that was... That was, yeah, Scrubs. That was a TV show. Sometimes we slip TV shows in there. You do. Well, I mean, I do. It's, it's part of my memory. What I, would you say? You do... <laughs> <laughs> I told you I'm a people person. <laughs> Can't keep pulling from the same movie, but I got to admit it is an awesome movie, dude. That one's got so many great lines. A lot of the movies we quote typically have a lot of great lines, which is why we can have those conversations that nobody knows what we're doing, and if they're even following, they're like three quotes behind. They're like, "Wait, where are they at now?" It's like, dude, we you know we we left John Hughes. We we've, we've gone over to like Tarantino. It's like, dude, we we've come back around again, and you're still on mm-hmm. step one. Going to Tarantino. I left my wallet in Tarantino. Did we go to Tarantino already? No, dude. Oh, dude, dude tell example. me you're not on a cell phone right now. Tell me you are not on a. Oh my god, you're here. <laughs> dude, what is what? Oh, what is that? Pulp Fiction, man. With the wait, wait. What scene is that? I'm trying. I'm trying. My brain's not. It's. It's got. A, it needs a second to come back around again. That yeah. was where they brought the dead kid from the car. That they shot accidentally to Quentin Tarantino's house. I don't remember that scene. Or well, not Quentin Tarantino's house, but it was he was playing that role. Yeah, Jimmy. Jimmy, yeah. Yeah, don't Jimmy me, man. Yeah, no, <laughs> dude. I don't I don't remember I don't remember that yeah, scene. Yeah, as, as as he's talking to him on the phone, he's like, tell me you're not calling from a cell phone. Run. Tell me you are not calling. I don't know you. I don't know you. No, no, no that, that that no, that was um when he was bringing uh, Uma Thurman. Yes. Yes, that's right. I'm yeah, sorry. No, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah. it was the cleanup different guy. Different scene sorry. where the dead person Same was movie, coming to another scene. house. Yeah. You're absolutely correct. How many dead people go to houses in that movie? Two we already know of. True. I know, but yeah, there's so many great lines True. in that yeah, one, too. Yeah, it was... Uh, well, and Kill Bill? Dude, oh, dude. Oh, was it Django Unchained? Oh, <laughs> Like what's what's his name? Christopherson. Um is it Chris Christopherson, yeah. right? Mm-hmm. I fucking love that dude. I got a man crush hard as shit on that dude for how well he acts and pulls off that like do he like sociopathic abilities almost. You know what I mean? Like his his, his method is so intense, like how he he portrays his character. Dude, it's fucking scary good. I mad love and respect for that dude. Like, yeah, I want to meet him someday and just like shake his hand, give him a hug, and just be like, I love you so much. You are such an amazing performer and you've made so many amazing scenes. Like, dude, I, yeah, I wanna I wanna fanboy all over that dude. I wanna get it in his hair. <laughs> wow. Okay. But dude, I, th- I thought we're in the green room. We're really is this not the tree of trust right now. Dude. This is absolutely the tree of trust. I have family listening. Can you be more respectful? <laughs> <laughs> This is respectful. No, oh. this is just a tribute. You're not my father. <laughs> <laughs> but but he doesn't... The, wait, what does he actually say? No, don't... don't stop. What? What does he actually say? Who? 
No, because it's Lord Vader look, tells like looks at him and tells me he's like you know search deep in your heart or whatever he's like you you will know the truth. And Look he, to the dark side. Well, yeah, no, because then Luke Luke says no. He's telling him no, and then no! Darth, yeah, and Darth Vader says yes, I am your father. But everybody always hears it as like you're not my father. He never says that. He never actually says that. No, that's true. He he never says that. Yeah, no, he just keeps telling him like no, 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 no. yeah. And his face all twisted up. Like, no. Yeah, and his freaking hand missing. Yeah, but yeah, no, Darth Vader is just like yes. I am your father. <laughs> yeah, that shit. Yeah, and by the way, Leia shot first. I said it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, only the true diehards are all over that one, which is why but dude, Leia shot first. Well, yeah, because like Family Guy, when they called the one Blue Harvest, that was the homage because that was the uh, the stage name of the fake movie they were making, so that nobody knew they were shooting the, the one of the Star Wars movies. Like that was. Oh ah, yeah. yeah. Oh. Yeah, because they want to keep it under wraps because it was like, you know. Yeah. Everybody wanted to know. Of course they did, man. But see like white lines. White lines. Blow all. I can't even can ride it, baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is the great dude. I'm telling you, the people, the people who listen to this show, dude, not only all right. So you guys are apparently on our level, and we we love you so much, fam. But like for real, mad mad respect and love for the fact you're listening to this, and it'll probably you're probably enjoying your dude. <laughs> I hope you peed yourself a little bit because I think I just did. Wow. Okay. No, I'm sorry. It was just beer. Just beer. Spilled some beer there. No, it was coming back out. I told you my dad jokes is better. Yeah. <laughs> I brings it. Oh, did you get it all over it? <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right, You're painting this really disturbing word picture. Dude, I mean, <laughs> all right. Can we take a break? I need to take care of stuff. You, you. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, only one beer. I don't know what happened. 9.6, I guess that's what happened. Hey, it's the S word, baby. <laughs> do what it do, baby. Well... It's been really cool and uh, absolutely well. We can keep pushing that. Reach out to us at I'm telling you at directions and music dot org, right? At I M T E L L I N Y O U <laughs> directions and music dot org. Um, Dude, no, I feel <laughs> all right. So I M T E L L I N Y O U at directions and music dot org. <laughs> I'm not a skip. No, I feel like there's like the. M O C K E Y M O U S E Mickey Mouse <laughs> Donald Duck. Sorry, right. somebody has to vote for Donald Duck. Uh, we're gonna crack a whole nother beer. So this Which, is gonna dude, get interesting. Dude, so please, Donald tune in. Duck always wears a shirt when he gets out of the shower. He's wearing a towel. What's that about? Why is he covering the part that he always leaves exposed? Exactly. I don't get it. And That's then a he's leaving job. all this, you know. He's le- he, letting all the hamburger hang out. <laughs> What is this, a sauna? This, this is inappropriate attire, sir. Yeah, where's your shirt with the little tie thingy? Where's your little... All right. Yeah. So we did... Okay, we did email, and then... All right, outro. Besides, dude, I'm baked. Is, but what? I've been drinking too much. Hanging out in the sun today. Dude, it was a long day. Yeah. That'll do that to you. It, well, it did, well, hopefully it you don't baby. pass out, because the, uh, the show is coming up next. Well, this is where we can tell them to click the button. If they can find it. You can. <laughs> We're going to do that again, huh? We need to educate. Why don't you tell them? All right. It's usually uh, back and to the left. <laughs> back and to the left. Back. <laughs> back Which, honestly, left. sometimes it is. You know what I mean? But sometimes it's got to be like counterclockwise or you got to go clockwise. Sometimes it's like up and down, back and forth, left and right, right and left, down and up. I mean, 
This you just know. got really inappropriate. It's the fucking B side. I swear. <laughs> <laughs> next next time I slap you, your mama gonna feel it. All right. That's All right. terrible. But if we have to end with that, then we will. I mean, I would mic drop, but these are expensive. <laughs> That was bad. <laughs> Dude, that was a great dad joke. If you say so. Who are you to well, judge? Well, you're the only one rating them, I guess. <laughs> I can't leave you to rate them. They'd be like... Well, much love to everyone out there. Thanks for listening. Oh, be good to yourself. Be good to others. No, be good to yourself. Be good to everyone else. Everybody. Just be good. Just To overall, everything else? Just... Wait, hold on. <laughs> are you... I just... Twice. Really? I'm allergic to good shit. (laughs) (laughs) All right, everybody. All right, peace. Peace.